Hey, Byron. This is more just a response to your second comment than it is to your video itself. But um, basically, you said you thought that all abstract cognition was rooted in the body via metaphor. And I was wondering if you thought that there was, if you could make a distinction between sensory experience and bodily experience, and if in reality they aren't actually one bodily experience, um, where, you know, vision, we might see, think that we are separate from the world and we see things that are out there as opposed to in here. But uh, as far as all the other senses are concerned, when I am touched, it's not separate from me. When I taste, it's certainly not separate from me. And when I hear, it's not separate from me. Like when you hear your name called, by someone, you have to react. Um, you cannot hear someone speaking and not process that speech on a higher perceptual level. It's entering you, and there's nothing you can do about it. I mean, you could zone out, but even subliminally, it's still entering your body. So I, I think vision is the only sense that makes us feel that we could ever conceptualize beyond mere metaphor, because metaphor, it seems, yeah, it's like this or like that. Concepts are supposed to be the thing itself. But if, if it's all rooted in the body, can we really have this pure, abstract, conceptual world of forms? Um, so that's really just a rhetorical question, but the question at the beginning that I asked about sense, do you think the senses are in any way distinguishable from the body and our experience of being a body is the real question I was trying to get to, so let me know what you think.